Hey y'all, it's Chef Matt coming to you from the Ricante Sauce Kitchen and today we are making salad rolls. It's a great healthy snack that you can take with you down to the beach, take it to, to the office for lunch, uh, whatever you'd like. This is what we got going. So I've got these beautiful rice paper wraps. We're going to talk about those in a little bit. I've got some vermicelli noodles. I've got some uh, beautiful cucumber, red pepper carrot, avocado. I've got some ground turkey that I cooked up with some of this ricante tamarindo sauce. And I've got some lettuce that we're going to put into the lettuce rolls. What we end up with today is one of these beauties. This is a salad roll and you can see the gorgeous ingredients inside. We've got some basil leaf and you can see the ground turkey and the rice vermicelli and the carrots, all that stuff. So let's get to it so you can see how to make this. I'm going to give you a good view of my cutting board and let's make this happen. Okay, so first of all, you've got the rice paper. This stuff you can get at any major grocery store, no problem. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to dip it in cold water for just a few minutes. Not even a few minutes, a few seconds is what I mean to say. So we get it nice and wet, swirl that water around on there. It's not going to feel totally soft, but as it sits on my cutting board and we fill it, it will soften up. Put it down there. I'm going to start with a little bit of basil leaf. So I lay that down just about a third of the way up. On top of that, I'm going to put a spoonful of my ground turkey. And the best thing about this is you could do this with ground pork or shrimp, uh, ground turkey, ground chicken, or just vegetarian. That is totally fine. So next up, we're going to put some of the rice vermicelli noodles. Doesn't need a whole lot. Just like a couple tablespoons worth. So we pile that on. Next up, a little bit of this cucumber. What I did with the cucumber is I scooped out the seeds. So I just had the meat of that cucumber left and I also peeled the outside. And then I sliced it into small slices. So it's kind of pliable. It's not real hard. That way it won't poke through the the rice paper wrapper. Put that down. Next up, julienne red pepper. So thin slices of red pepper, also soft, uh, so that it doesn't poke through uh, the rice paper wrapper. Some shredded carrot. Awesome. Sweetness, deliciousness. Then we've got some avocado, and I just cut the avocado in half and made slices, and then I'll just scoop out a couple pieces and lay it right over the top. That looks great. Last but not least, we got the lettuce. And really, your way is any way you want to do this. You like a lot of lettuce, you can do that. Less lettuce, more noodles, whatever you'd like. So then we're going to take the, the uh, rice paper wrapper and sort of wrap it over the top, tuck in the ends, roll it forward. Bring the sides of the rice paper wrapper, just like you're wrapping a burrito. Boom. Looks good. Continue to roll it. This takes a little practice at first, but you'll get it. And there it is. There's the salad roll. So delicious. If you want to wrap these up in plastic and take them on a hike, you can do that. Next up, though, the best part, the ricante sauce. This recipe you can do with the tamarindo. I already cooked the, the chicken in this, so I'm not gonna use that one. We've got the guavana sauce you could do. There's the mango sauce, which I ran out of because it's so delicious. Today, I think what I'm gonna do for my dipping sauce is the ricante pineapple habanero. Uh, super delicious. Pour that into a little bit of a bowl here. And I've got my salad rolls. So nice, easy to, uh, easy to make, super delicious. Hope you guys have a great day and we'll see you next time for the next recipe.